So, well, Utasha um, and myself have been close friends for over 10 years. I think we've had a, a mutual respect and appreciation for, for what each other does. And uh, by the time it came to uh, uh, the Audrey's third album, um, it, the, it was just it was just the right time to be able to join forces and uh, create a create a beautiful piece of artwork to accompany um, one of their songs. I'd worked with um, Ari Gibson and Jason Hammett in the past, and I'd seen the the work that they had done on on the Cat Piano, which is a fantastic film, and and it just it it. It got a lot of accolades. I think it was, you know, I know it was actually shortlisted for an Academy Award. And I thought, well, I've got to get those guys working on this film. And so Shane DeVries, um, who's a fantastic Adelaide-based artist, um, we actually initially sat down and, and started to conceptualise the this initial concept. And he threw around some beautiful il illustration work, and I threw around a little bit. Um, as well, and we came up with this initial base for a story. Well, then, then I took this base um, for the story and uh, just presented it to Ari and, and Jason, and uh, I was just thrilled that they they loved the core idea. Um, it's a very uh, emotive idea; it's quite emotional, and they just grabbed the bull by the horn, so to speak, and just fleshed out that idea and and really, really. Um, enrich the idea and um, as a result it was what you, what I would refer what I would call a true collaboration when Luke first introduced the concept it was really it was it was very vivid we heard the song and it was a beautiful song and it was very evocative and this idea of this girl traveling this lonely girl kind of traveling towards the star conjured up some amazing imagery and it seemed like it seemed like a brilliant opportunity for us to be involved. The film took three, about three and a half months from start to finish and Jason and I came on board probably a few weeks in when some conceptualisation had already been started but with a very different kind of look. I think she was very pleased. Um, there were tears. There were tears. Definitely tears. Which is always a good sign. Yep. No, no, not at all. People love it. Yeah, yeah. I, there, there's a reaction to two. There's a much more primal reaction to two D. I think because it's so much closer to to drawings, which is something that everyone does as a child and everyone can relate to. And there's something about watching drawings move. That, that has a soul to it that 3D never will. And like, and 3D, I'm not, I'm not saying 3D can't, you can't relate to it and it can't be beautiful. It is often, but there's a quality to that, to 2D that can never be matched. It sort of, epitomizes you know creativity it's sort of creativity at, at its max I think especially when you're given uh, such flexibility like the Audrey's gave us they really gave us um, uh, license to really be able to, to come up with something that we thought was fitting there was a good understanding and I think that I think that if other uh, bands wanted to perhaps uh, you know approach us as a, as a group, you know, that's the only prerequisite. They give us absolute freedom to do whatever we please. Mm -hmm.